Um, it was good. We knew we had to slow things down from a teaching standpoint. You know, you only got a couple kids uh, at certain positions. You got one inside linebacker, one outside linebacker, two corners, one safety. So um, our plan as a coaching staff was to get out of here for about an hour, really technique oriented, get guys back, uh, and just spend some time. Because sometimes I think once you get to to Friday and all of a sudden you're back into scheme and everything's happening, there's 90 guys running around, everybody's flying around you. You know, these young guys can use as much practice time as they can. We haven't been with them since uh, June. So it was good to get back out here. I'm pleased with how they came back um, for the most part in shape and, and ready to go. And, you know, we got a good day of meetings and we'll finish up with some, uh, we got more meeting time tonight. And so really we're using just these two days as a, as just a, a, a way to get a little bit of a jump start before we really start. I think, you know, for us, official start of camp is probably Friday. So if the two rookies were on NFI because they didn't pass the conditioning test, when will be their next chance to pass that test? When the veterans test on Thursday. When the, okay. And What's how the point is it that those two guys weren't able to get through that? Your goal in life is playing in the NFL and get a pass condition test playing it, so ball's in their court. So What's the test system? We got a running test. Two miles? Or? It's about six. Six miles. It's a conditioning test. It's a series of sprints with a rest time in between, and it's all it varies by position. How exciting is it for you uh, to be out here finally for your first NFL training camp? You know, I don't look at it that way. I've been excited every day I've been here, so it's not. I, I, don't, I don't think. And I think our guys. I'm trying to get that mindset involved in all of them. It's not. Hey, let's get really excited because it's the first day of camp, and then the third day of camp, you're bored. You know, I think you got to be excited that every day you're out here, um, you get an opportunity to put, to work with a bunch of guys. We, we have an outstanding staff, and the players have been outstanding. You know, in terms of their reception and them wanting to get better. So I, I was excited when I got here on the 16th of January. You know, it's the same today. Just because we got a chance to get back out on the field, I don't think it changes it.